On the left side of the Rive editor, you'll find the Hierarchy panel. This is where you can see all your layers in order for their corresponding artboard. If I highlight a different artboard, you'll see that the hierarchy changes. You can rename layers in your hierarchy by double clicking and then typing out your new name and tapping enter. You can also reorder layers by clicking and dragging and then letting go. And of course you can group layers by highlighting your selection, tap shift and click and then tap command G to group these layers. I'm going to call this group face because it contains all of the layers of the character's face. As you can see, the layers contained within the group are now indented. This is just to show that they are contained within the group. Another way to say it is that the group is a parent and the layers within the group are its children. When I change the position of the group, its children move too. When I rotate the group, or scale it, the children inherit that scaling and rotation. But what really is the point of groups? Well, let's say these layers were not in a group. Let's just move them up and out of the group and then delete the empty group. If I wanted to animate them all moving up and down in a nod, I would have to highlight them all and then move them all up and down. This would create keyframes for each layer. However, if I use a group, once again, command G, it means I can move the entire face as one layer. This simplifies and decreases the number of keyframes that I have to use, lessening the workload and keeping my file small and performant. Before animating, we highly recommend putting all of your layers into a group called root. Root is a group that you will never ever animate. However, it is very useful because you can animate any of the layers that you want and then to change the overall composition of your animation, you can move root around and scale it or even rotate it. And this change of composition isn't going to affect any of the keyframes in your child layers.